Welcome back to Clover Collectibles, where we are going to be cracking open some Double Masters 2022. Just got it fresh in today. Mm -hmm. We're going to be doing this one kind of like a pack battle, where Frank is going to get half of the box, I'm going to get the other half. And then when we go to the collector's boosters later, it'll be box versus box to see who can find an Imperial Seal faster. This is our Mimeoplasm. They've got Mimeoplasm in this one? Yeah. Woo! Everybody's dying for that yeah. one. <laughs> you know you need your foil borderless Mimeoplasm. Yeah, I wonder what that one's Four at. for you. Thank you. Four for me. And the box. Uh, it is $5.12 for the borderless one. So that's the, nice. the big money. This is going to be confusing at the beginning because these are complicated. These are probably one of the most complicated packs they have ever made. Well, the, the, in terms of the how collectors are. Yeah. And then I believe this is Japanese manufactured, so our rares should be near the front of the pack. I'm starting off yes. with a bear token, so I like that. That's always a good start. And a It's a 4-4 four, four bear token. What kind of monster bear is that? <laughs> Big old bears. Yeah. Then we'll each get a cryptic spires in every pack. Okay, that scared the bejesus yeah, out of me already. It's your mana fixing for the draft. Okay. Then you'll have your foil. That's a good start. Son of a... That is a foil cavern of souls. Uh, so, is that supposed to be there? I mean, there's your foil. Oh, that's where the foil spot is. Yes. Where's your I don't even know where the spots are, but not a, not a bad pit start for it. Yeah. Um, that's the foil work. rare, that, or the foil anything? Uh, there's going to be two foils in each pack, so your next one will be a foil as well. Okay. Let's see, do we double up? No. <laughs> no, we don't. Oh, I should probably put this aside. Yes. And we've got an Abbot of Carol Keep for me. Glimpse the Unthinkable. You are definitely ahead. Yeah. And Zer. Jeskai Ascendancy. And then we have our Uncommon Saber. Should be three. Lash. Eternal Witch. Cynic Growth Chamber. That's okay. The, the borderless Usable. ones, right? Or... The borderless ones are going for a little bit. And then anywhere in the pack, you may have a borderless card slipped in throughout. So I got our Seven. Rampant Growth. Okay. Blood Flow, Scour, Squire. What? They just had a bunch of those. Uh, that was excellent. Lava coil. I just, within my lifetime, <laughs> that was <laughs> all of magic. That was like two days ago, as per my internal timeline of magic. We have found old man Frank's yeah. day. I, I kind of like and don't like the Japanese allocation where everything's at the front, because mm -hmm. it's like you you get it over quickly, quickly. when you're cracking packs. But if you want the anticipation, it's not there. Yeah, I like the anticipation already. My God, it's a cryptic spot. Cryptic. <laughs> I got me too. It got me. I'm like, how'd you know? Lee uh, Guild Auger Spree. Narrowback Rhino. Experiment One. Grimflyer. Drog Skull Reaver. Merc Tide Lee. Terial. Souls. Inquisition of Kozilek Borderless. That's Very that's nice. pretty good. I, I do like that they put Cold Steel Heart back in. That thing's needed a reprint. Mm -hmm. Mentor of the Meek. Control. Spinner. Heroes. Secret Amulet. of the Way Borderless. Sovereign. Experiment 1. Riffball. Okay. Yeah, I like, I like having the drama. I like having the, ooh, what's the last one? Because then it's like... Excitement, and then, okay, we're just wasting time. Yeah. It's like eating the center of the Oreo and then having to eat the cookie part afterwards. You're just, this is just disappointment. <laughs> I gotta be careful to be slow with the zombie. Spire. Mole Drifter foil. Go for the throat. Knightly Valor foil. Makeshift Molar. Lord of Extinction. Master mythic. of Cruelties for my first mythic. Okay. Five bucks, I think. Yeah, Lord of Extinction is that bad. Uh, Sky Summoner. Ooh, Rare. Terrible. Not great. Restoration Angel. Aether Mage Touch. Domestication. Sanctuary. Wars of Spell Pierce. And a Kazali Pride Mage. Yeah, it's freaking me out that there's all these somewhat relative, relatively new cards in the, in the common <laughs> and uncommons. You say that, like, Seeker Squire was four years ago? Five yeah. Five years ago? That's way too recent. <laughs> like, if you're having a master set, I'm expecting, like, Antiquities cards. Mm-hmm. Arabian Nights. You say that, then they'll just reprint stuff All like Drafna's uh, Restoration. Cryptic Spire. Annoyed Altasaur. Deep Analysis. Doomed Traveler. That might be worth something. Force Negation. Hey, very nice. That's you are one. kicking my ass. Oracle of Mulder. And Harmonicon and a Mind Rack Liege. I've gotten two Lieges so far. That's not great. Grave Blade. Agony Warp. That one's fun. Doomed Traveler. That's always beautiful. Next one. So we have, uh, what, Kozilek, we have the Lily, Ulamog, 
Ulamog. Emrakul. Uh, we need Holds. a Lord Boyf. Cryptic Spire. Cryptic Spire again. And a bear. Aqueduct. Chronicler of Heroes. Anointer of Valor. Ooh, this Cold one. Guns Command. Fire. It's like they give you two foils, but they don't promise that there'll be anything good. Fiery oh. Justice. Teneb the Harvester. Dragons. Banshee. Yeah, Henny, Undying Partisan. Okay, some people like it. He's yeah, usable. Vampire Rites. Splicers. Burning Tree Emissary. Thrive. Perforos. Any other surprising cards in this one? There's a lot of, like, odd stuff that we didn't expect. Uh, just the fact that Imperial Seal is in there yeah. makes it worth it for me. I need, like, two or three of them. <laughs> Zombie. Spire. Thousand Year Storm foil. A uh, borderless foil. Nice. Yeah. That's a couple of bucks. Glimpse the Unthinkable foil. Hey, two fo uh, rares in a pack. Nice. Yeah. And that's just in the two rares in the foil. Yep. Phyrexian Altar. It's you, good pack. You good are pack. kicking my butt. I got a Sphinx and a Pithing And a, a Splinter Fright. Boo. Yeah, well, they all can't be winners. That's what Mom I mean, said when I was of, born. Some of them can well, right be, now. except any of the ones I'm opening. No. Well, I got the good <laughs> side. Clearly, these are side-biased. We don't know yet. It could you want be. Left Twix. If I remember right, every opening I've seen so far in the rare slots, mm -hmm. the first card of the rare slots has been where the Mythics are. Okay. So I don't know if it's like Double Masters Original with the VIP packs where you could only get a Mythic in one slot. Oh, uh, where two. it wasn't even possible? You couldn't double Mythic? You couldn't double Mythic. So I think that might be true here as well Stagger until I'm, shock. you know, proven otherwise. Vampiric Rites. Hey, Shadowborn Apostle. Needed okay. a reprint. A Tarka's Command. Imperial Guided Archangel. Passage. And That's Hostage it. Taker used to be worth a lot of money. Not so much yeah, anymore. Back in the day. Chancery. Brindle. <laughs> there might be some background noise because we are not in our normal location during renovations. Yep. Ooh, a fairy rogue token. Elemental. Cryptic spires. A vampire sovereign. Foil borderless unearth. Okay. Ground assault. Militia bugler. Monastery mentor. Moldrotha borderless. Okay. Oh, the mana drain. Okay, yeah, you I'm, definitely won I this. I picked the left side, 100% left <laughs> side, because that is uh, a bit better. But on the right side, you could get Figure of Destiny that didn't even need a reprint. <laughs> Rancor, Flicker Wisp. Mm. Oh, Path. Helix. Is Path worth anything? Yeah, Path is still okay, worth money. Good. And a Coiling Oracle borderless. Is Path worth anything? <laughs> oh, borderless monastery? That might be a, a dollar. You know. uh, it'll probably be a couple of bucks because now it's a common, so it's now in pauper burn. Ah, we make it worth more by making it worth less. Mm -hmm. Slow. Drake. Spires. Deadly Recluse for Conclave Spider Tribal. Mentor. Stitchwing. Scab. And a Hellkite. Lean and Arbiter. Planar Bridge. That's normal. Bedlam Reveler. Hey. And yeah, Planar Bridge did in. not need a reprint. No. Lightning Bolt. Hey, Lightning Bolt. Lightning's good. It just got reprinted in Commander Legends 2, but okay. <laughs> Why not? It's, it's for not. limited. Some You need some We, we need a Lightning spells. Bolt. You can have unlimited number of Lightning Bolts in your deck. I can make a Lightning Bolt tribal. Just so when I play, I can just yell, Lightning Bolt! Lightning Bolt! <laughs> I wonder what he's going to play next. Bear. Dragon Arch. Traveler's Amulet. Liliana's Elite. I got very excited when I started yep. seeing Liliana. Yeah. M.E.L. the Blessed. I got the Unicorn. Yeah, Unicorn Tribal. Hydroid Death Crisis. Crisis. Dota. Uh, okay. Interesting. Interesting. Some people cards. like Five Color Empty. Commander. Yeah. We need some more Urza-inspired cards. Well, that's for Demer uh, Dominaria, Dominaria coming back. When are they coming back? It's a new... Uh, with Phyrexia, right? Are they doing it with Phyrexia this time? Or are they keeping Phyrexia out of it? I haven't looked too far into it, but I know it's going to be in the fall. Bring so back Yawkmoth. Bant Charm Foil. Rampant Growth. Lava Coil. Dauntless Supreme Escort. Verdict. And a Skullbriar. A Greater Gargadon. Oh, God. Yeah. Biogenic. Washout. Okay. Last pack of the box. That was quick. Well, it's only 24 packs. Oh, and there's not a box topper, is there? No, oh. no box toppers. 
Disappointment. Egg token. But they put them in the packs. Yeah. So. Titan Strength. Elvish Rejuvenator. Disappointment. Battle Axe. Pa Panharmonicon Borderless. Okay. So that's not too bad. And Rishkar. Green Sun Zenith. Spider. Jeskai. No and Shatterborn. the rest is eh. So uh, I, I think my side won. Yeah, you I would absolutely say. crushed it's, uh, me. It's easy to say. Is... Let's see. We got Mana Drain, yeah. Monastery Mentor, Frick. I should probably do it so we can see. Monastery Mentor, Phyrexian Altar, Glimpse the Unthinkable, Thousand Year Storm. That is actually a beautiful looking card. Mm -hmm. It does well with the foil. Yeah, they Force did really negation. well on the new art for things in this set. Lord, and the first one, which is probably by far the most beautiful, it's the Foil Cavern. So, not too shabby. We'll calculate the I got the a Moldrotha. Uh, should we calculate the total amount and let them know what it was? Yeah, might as well. Okay, Let's, we'll uh, pause it and then come back and we'll see. We'll see you back in a minute. And we're back. Oh. Seems like... Well, oh yeah, you absolutely crushed me. Yeah. Uh, my side of the box had $67.40 worth of cards in it that were, you know, above $3, $4. Uh, Frank's side of the box had $316.27. So this teaches you pick the left side of the box. Yeah. That, 100%. That is, we at, proven out of our one of, of one box. An N of one, 100% of the boxes we have opened <laughs> have double five masters, times the value. Five times the value in the, in the left side. Oh, so, and the top. And the t left top. Go left top. <laughs> that is the best. I went, should he get the top or the bottom? I gave you the top. The first one you opened had foil cavern of souls in it. I should have just stopped opening packs at that point. You have chosen poorly. poorly. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll see you all next. We'll probably do a battle of the collectors uh double masters and see if those are really worth what they're supposed to be will mm -hmm. we get a huge amount of value or will we get hosed find out probably next. hosed on my side <laughs> <laughs> if, if the long history has taught us anything come on imperial seal yeah all right guys we'll catch you in the next one